This is one of the beaches on Long Island. I have made it to a magical land, um, <laughs> but it's closing now. That's it. This is the last Kmart. Um, sorry, I'm not counting that one in Miami. It's like the size of a shoebox. Uh, doesn't count. This is it. That's the last Kmart. It's going to be closed in two weeks, and somehow I made it here. I have no idea how the heck I made it here, but I'm here. So <laughs> let's... I haven't been to a Kmart in like nine years. Uh, it took like nine hours to get here. <laughs> um, <laughs> so let's go walk around and see what we can find. Look at that. How sad is that? Store closing. Look at that. An open Kmart, but not for long. All our beautiful Kmart cards. Wish I could have one. They don't even say Kmart on them. This really is the promised land. Let's uh let's go in. This is it. Um this this place is really, really sad. Uh, doesn't it doesn't really give me too much of a Kmart vibe uh, right now, but that's probably because the store is about to close. It reminds me of a very sad Big Lots, actually. Um, there's quite a lot of people here, of course, for the closing sales. Um, yeah, let's continue. All right. 50% off. How much would these be? Kind of cool. Um, metal bar stools. So these would be 35 bucks a piece. Kind of tempting. That's plastic. So this is the last Kmart in the United States. In the lower 48. Um, all right. Tents, chairs. Bluish gray color on the wall. <laughs> oh, look at all this clothing. Wow. I could tell that this store was pretty nice um, when it was a non closing store. I wonder if I'll find a Kmart souvenir anywhere. Sales final. As far as store closings, ones I can remember being at were Ames, seven uh, in Parma, and the Value City in Parma.
<laughs> Lots of swimwear. How busted up this linoleum is. It's crazy to see these. Okay, Mark. Suppose I could get. Wow. Candy section. Nobody wants good and plenties. Makeup section. This has been picked bare. And look at this section. They've already shut that down. Very, very depressing. Everything must go. I don't know what these are. These, they're, yeah, more merchandise. And it looks like whatever was on the wall has been taken down already. Now this furniture confused me because doesn't this furniture look used? Like look how stained it is. So this is 125 for the set. Was this in the break room? It probably is worth 125 for the whole set. Well, this is a Sears tent. It's from the Kmart tent sale. And these are, oh yeah, this is like a fixture sale. That's kind of nice. Must be like break room chairs. Yeah. All these filing cabinets. Look at all these mannequins. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Goodbye, Kmart. Wow. This is unbelievable. map of Long Island. Pictures. This was the Kmart that really hung on, but not anymore. Now, I have some regrets. Um, when everybody was out there documenting the closing Kmarts a few years ago, a lot of them closed in like 2019, 2020. Um, I kind of just sat by and watched. I watched. 
Um, I did not participate. I'm not sure why I did that. I think I just was too sad to go into one and just I was more of a spectator at that time because Kmart was such a part of my childhood and early adulthood. But at the time that a lot of the closings were going on, I just was like, it's too sad to even go in one. But now I'm here. I'm here at a closing. And this must be what it felt like for everybody that made it to the closing. It's just sad, feeling like it's the end of an era. There's nothing you can do about it. I really would like a souvenir. Does Kmart still sell Martha Stewart's? Hmm. Bed spreads? Not bad. Wish I had a Kenmore dryer or a Kenmore washer. This is what I'm going to get for my souvenirs. Bridgehampton and Sag Harbor. Which will remind me of this Kmart forever and ever and ever. <gasps> Look at these. These are nice too. Oh, wow. I kind of might need one of these too. The straw is plastic. That's nice. Wow. That's nice too, actually. It is feeling bare. Oh, wow. This reminds me of Seven Hills. I mean, any Kmart had this. The fitting rooms? Wow. Nearly took off the sign. Women's fitting room. I feel like I spent many a time in a Kmart fitting room. See, maybe we could get some uh, fitting room reviews in here. Fitting room reviews. <laughs> oh my goodness. If you find this fitting room needs attention, please contact one of our friendly associates. Very bizarre to see a Kmart being open. Wow. This is unbelievable. Huh. Hats are kind of nice. crappy C Kelly Clarkson song has to be playing. What in the heck is that? That is weird. This will be the last, no, this won't be the last time I go into a Kmart. Because I think I am going to go to the Miami one. But one of the last for sure. You get this and you get this and cut it. I want to get a picture of the customer service desk. Documenting history. K 
Kmart is dying. Making me crazy every time I look around. Not some plastic pools, kayaks, bunch of beach toys. That's kind of cool. A COVID 19 announcement in the Kmart. These greeting card shelves are very old school looking, very Kmart looking to me. Um, yeah, there's something about these greeting card shelves. I used to have a job when I was younger that uh, I counted merchandise in stores and I would count the um, greeting cards. And they liked to put me on cards because they needed accuracy. Look at this. Not sure what that is. Interesting, though. This is the closed off section of the Kmart. This is our restroom area. Here's your restroom review. It smells. It's not that bad, though. These are all bikes. This is in front of the store. Well, that's it. That's the Kmart. Thank you for shopping the Bridgehampton Kmart. Wonder why that's already been taken down. Even these benches look, um, they just look vintage. I mean, 90s something. They are retro to me. Maybe not to some people, but they're retro to me. And that's it. That is it. That's it for Kmart. And that completes my tour of the Bridgehampton Kmart that is closing. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you on the next video.